Now, imagine yourself working as a front-end web developer. You've just gotten a design from your company's graphic designer, and you now need to take this image or PDF file and turn it into a website with all of the necessary components, HTML files, CSS files, and JavaScript files. Yeah. But how do you translate that visual design into an actual website, right? You know, where do you start? What decisions do you have to make? What do you need to know? And these are like excellent questions mm -hmm. to ask. Uh, but before we do that, we should probably build a good conceptual understanding of the way websites work. Yep, exactly. So you can think of a website much like your house. Um, HTML files are like the structure. Uh, where are the walls placed? Uh, what room is your living room? What room is your kitchen? Which room is your bedroom? CSS files are then the style of your house. What color is the carpeting? What decorations do you have up? What color are the walls? JavaScript files are then your interactive components. You can think of them like your garage door opener or your television remote. They're changing some element of your house. Now, much like there are rules for how things in your house behave, you can't have a television that's just floating on the wall. It has to be attached by something. There are also rules for how websites behave. The same goes for tools. Uh, you can't put together a bookshelf, for example, without a screwdriver. And there are also many web tools available to help you build your websites. Yeah, it's a great point. I love this analogy. It's mm -hmm. an awesome analogy. What do you say we get started in learning some of the basics? Sounds great.